uh, over 10 million Filipino foreign uh, overseas Filipino workers who are sending money back to the Philippines. It's still a pretty expensive proposition today to send money because of the traditional ways by which we we exchange or we send this money from from one country to the other, right? That involves setting up uh, you know relationships with different banks across different countries and and setting up uh, settlement accounts and, and and so on. One of the projects that IBM is doing along with certain partner banks is this project called Worldwide. And again, the idea here is can we speed up and reduce the costs of transmitting money from one country to the other by using blockchain as this system of record among the different banking participants. Right? So again, this, this project is live today and we're actually talking to a few banks already about possible interest in joining this network. Right? Now, so I've shared with you some of the blockchain networks that IBM has set up, you know, that, you know, some of you, depending on which industry you are in, you might be interested to look into. Feel free to contact us in IBM. Feel free to get in touch with, you know, your, your people from MSI. MSI, they will know how to get back to us on this, right? But if you don't see a network where you can participate in, or maybe you want to start setting up your own blockchain network, right? These are some of the options also where IBM can help, right? So the blockchain technology that IBM supports is called Hyperledger. It's an open source project owned by the Linux Foundation. So it's not even our product, right? We don't make money on Hyperledger. Uh, you can go to the Linux Foundation website and download the code for, for Hyperledger if you want to try it out on your own. The base code, however, much of the code that is part of that Hyperledger fabric came from IBM. We developed the code and then we donated that into the open source uh, community. Right? Where IBM does make money on this is if you don't want to set up your own servers to run the blockchain uh, infrastructure, then you can actually go to IBM and we have it offered as a service on the cloud. Right? So instead of buying your own servers, installing Hyperledger on those servers and running them and so on, you can go to IBM and pay for the Hyperledger uh, blockchain as a service. Okay? You can use, you can access Hyperledger either on the IBM Cloud, the traditional IBM Cloud, or for certain industries, for example, where you may have regulatory requirements like PCI DSS or, or uh, I mean, it's a healthcare, right? And you need a higher level of security for the infrastructure to run your, your blockchain network. The high security business network is an IBM cloud offering that runs blockchain on a mainframe. Right? So that 